You guys, terrible news. Clara has to leave me. It is 6.30 in the morning. It's 6.30 in the morning and it is freezing and I'm eating cold waffles. Good morning from Texas. Bye, Claire. Bye. <laughs> we'll see you on the next adventure. Okay. Well, good morning again. I'm in one of these lovely Texas picnic areas over here on uh, some random highway. And uh, yeah, it was a little bit too early for me to wake up this morning. It was like on Texas 6 a.m. or something. And uh, yeah, so just pulled over. Nope, really nobody bothered me. It was just this uh, amazing landscape here. And uh, today we're gonna head, I think I mentioned this before, I head towards Austin. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get there today or tomorrow. I have a friend who I wanna see. Also, there's another friend in town tomorrow. I'm not really sure how to schedule this, so why don't we just hit the road and we'll just figure it out once we get a little bit closer. By the way, when you're in rural Texas, driving on the uh, shoulder is totally A-OK. -okay. In fact, many people drive on the shoulder to let people pass in the regular lane. I just happen to be over here because I'm going 20 miles under the speed limit. I'm going 55 speed limit out here is 75 for some reason. Definitely not driving down the adventure bus 75 miles an hour. <laughs> This is what the entrance looks like, and uh, I'll show you what the parking area looks like once I get there. Well, I'm SOL here. Seems like uh, parks <laughs> next to uh, the river are closed in uh, wintertime in Texas. Well, that's a bummer. I just wanted to hang out next to the water, so I'll just go hang out at a rest stop now. <laughs> All right, here we go. What's in Jax's uh, fridge and freezer? Round two. More of these organic vegetables. California blend. I was telling Lucas today, my best friend, this he's the only thing I miss from California. So, Lucas, I miss you, man. Thanks for watching all the videos. Uh, also, got some more of this kefir stuff. Great uh, probiotic. We got some hummus. And then we got 99% lean turkey uh, fillets, strips. Uh, and then... I actually got some yams up here. Those are pretty good. Although they do call them sweet potatoes. They are not sweet potatoes. They are yams. Got to keep it lean. And day in the adventure bus. Lean. Nice. Bus machine. <laughs> Whatever. Anyways, today is going to be a pretty uneventful day. I think I'm going to just head towards a little rest stop. And uh, hit Austin, Texas tomorrow. For dinner, th these are the 99% uh, lean turkey uh, fillets. I uh, got these over at the uh, Home Away From Home Walmart. Check these bad boys out. Not organic, but uh, I wish they were. Not a bad price either. Uh, $4.50 a pound for lean, very lean, very fat free uh, chicken. I just have them cooked up in some uh, little touch of olive oil. With some of this here uh, creole sauce then I got um, I'm gonna cook meals in advance I'm doing sweet potatoes in here not to be confused with the yams I'm gonna do the yams afterwards and then I'll be doing some uh, vegetables here so I think I'm gonna start to do a little meal prepping and uh, 
perhaps freeze freeze meals in advance or dinners or lunches dinners and then just take them out and thaw them put them in a bag you know uh, and then just eat them on a go so that'll be need to get rid of my winter coat but um, as you can see I'm over here at this beautiful rest area very nice sunset right now and I found this uh, rest area using an app called Trucker Path and uh, the truckers say how many spots there are, how busy it is, things like that. And uh, anytime you are at the rest stop closest to a big city, um, it gets busy quick. So early bird gets definitely gets a worm over here. But if you got like a small bus, you can always squeeze in someplace. So, all right. I suppose if I tell you about it, and I don't show you it, someone will, someone will inevitably ask me to show my meal prep so I'm not following any guide whatsoever these are those strips I, I, I showed you a minute ago I just seasoned with the creel sauce and all these are individual small little pieces whoops so that one as you can see is like kind of the palm of my hand <coughs> everything's on the smaller size I also have this is a yam that's pretty small in size too uh, here's a sweet potato so that's, you know, long, but, you know, still kind of small. These are pretty small. So anyways, meat, I'm going to do one piece of meat, modest size piece. I'm going to do one potato. And I'm going to do some kind of, like, scoop of this vegetable mix. I have two more packages here. And then, these will be ready-to-eat meals. So I'll probably put most of them in the freezer, except for, like, four. And then just pull one out whenever I want to eat. And then have a... Well, mostly balanced diet. Um, we got the protein, complex carbohydrate, vegetables, more yams cooking in here. So anyways, that's my day today. I guess it was meal prep day and I didn't even know it. <laughs> so uh, I will catch you guys uh, probably tomorrow. Although I might have an action-packed day. I do have a call with my psychic. That runs about an hour. Um, I might have like... A business kind of meeting for that show thing so I don't know what's going on tomorrow but if not I'll pick it up the next day uh, I'm gonna swing by and say hi to Alice I think we're gonna go out for a day and check some things out um, but as always thank you so much for watching I appreciate you spending your time with me and uh, we'll catch you on the next one